Yo, what is up everybody and welcome to a NBA 2K14 team up gameplay. As you see, we are the OKC Thunder. If you could recognize my gamer tag, if you don't, I am Serge Ibaka. And I'm also playing with a few other people. I'm playing with Ushbag, who I play with quite often in team play stuff, whether it's Man or 2K. He's got Russell Westbrook. And then there's also another buddy of ours who goes by Town Baller, that ex Town Baller um, gamer tag. And he is Kevin Durant. So we didn't pick these guys. We just, you know, happened to get matched up with the three best players on OKC. So that made for a fun game. We're also going against the Houston Rockets with James Harden, Chandler Parsons, Dwight Howard. So, you know, it's going to be a tough matchup i'm going against ashik so i don't have a big matchup to worry about defensively but um as far as rebounding ashik is pretty beastly on the board so i'm about to see what i could do there and here's the surge baka trying to hit that mid-range jumper could not get it to go and um i got that one point early on just by you know running the four and Ushbag found me he's westbrook and he was you know dishing quite a few assists and he it was this game was like a real life okc thunder game i'm gonna tell you that much all right and if you watch okc thunder games you've might know what to expect from now <laughs> until the end. As you see, I tipped the pass with a Baca here, Russell Westbrook. Eh, all right, still our ball, all good. And that's just what Westbrook does, man. Out of control, but sometimes he makes the good plays. Finding KD on the lob, and um, you know Jeff, he's his um thing is town ball, but we just call him Jeff. He was balling out with KD for the most part, as you're gonna see. I bring Collison as my replacement. Um, push back brings in Reggie Jackson and. I don't even know. I don't even know if Kevin Durant actually left the game or not. Not like Kevin Durant needs to leave the game since, you know, he's never tired as we get the offensive rebound and the putback with Collison. And uh, one thing about um, an actual OKC game that went on is that I kind of got, you know, shut out of the offense after, like, the first quarter. I was pretty much done with playing offense. It was pretty much um, re re um re Russell Westbrook, Kevin Durant, and sometimes the shooting guard would take some like weird three pointers and that was it man i was like shut out the offense that's some straight up okc thunder stuff because when the okc thunder plays Serge Ibaka, you see he's got it going on like in the first half you'll see he's like five for six or something he's knocking out all those mid-range jumpers and then he gets like one attempt in the second half because westbrook and durant are just like going crazy and every once in a while karam butler will jack up a three point or something so i mean it was kind of like that not that i don't mind i mean i feel like you know in team play, you don't get to choose who you are. Um, this team up when you just randomly match up, you don't get to choose who you're gonna be. You just end up with people. So I, I could play both ways, man. I, I could be a good teammate. I could just set screens throughout the game, which is Nick Collison's game. So I mean, I'm I'm Serge, but I'm also Nick. So I gotta set the screens. I gotta do all the dirty work. I gotta get the rebounds. I gotta play good defense in the paint, protect the rim, and sometimes throw the ball up the court to KD and let KD get the assist. And I get the little pass to assist there. So. I mean, it's all good. And then every once in a while, you know, I'll get the Kevin Durant-like player, and I'll be able to go off. So, you know, let, let Ushbag and Jeff get the shine for today. And I'll play the defense, man. I'll protect the paint. But, unfortunately, I get called for my second foul there. Harden somehow found his way up there. As you see, they do the charge. She's an Ushbag there. Call, getting him caught there. But then he gets the steal off the inbounds play only to get Block just completely rejected by Willie Terrence Jones and then Chandler Parsons cherry picking down and they're up by 12 points and early on we were a mess man we were a mess until all of a sudden we got a spark going that Russell Westbrook and one spark team you see Garcia out to Parsons Parsons for three getting it to go but what we needed to, was to play a little bit of defense man more than anything we couldn't allow so many points in the first half of a team play game because they're on pace to score almost 100 points so we had to get a few stops which we were doing though on offense you know once we start getting the stops on defense on offense it was a mess and part of the reason why they were getting so much stuff on defense was my fault I, I would just give up some dumb stuff. I was not, um, I couldn't get used to a Bacchus jumping, jump timing to get blocks. Though there, we got our first block of the game, finally. So now we're starting to figure it out a little bit with a Baca. We get the block there. Jeremy Lin coming back into the paint. But Serge says, nah, nah, we got the rebound. And look at Kevin Durant. Jeff was cherry picking all game, man. Jeff had a great offensive game, but he was cherry picking. He didn't need Durant to cherry pick. He was just doing it. As you see, Omer Ashik getting rejected by Serge. Serge E. Baca, Russell Westbrook to Durant, and Durant scoops it in, and it's a six point game before halftime. And then they try to throw the ball up court a little bit too ambitious because now it's our ball with five seconds left in the half. Westbrook out to Durant, or Butler, and Butler from downtown, and it's a three point game before half, actually going into the half. 
when they led the entire first half, they pretty much led wire to wire, but we closed it up before halftime, and that was huge. That gave us all the momentum heading into the second half. I feel like our defense is starting to come around. I'm starting to come around on defense, and um, I'm starting to figure out how to, you know, block out this freaking Omer Ashik, because Ashik was killing me on the boards, but there, see, Ashik tries to go up. Nah, nah, we put a hand up. Don't gotta get the block. It's all good, though. Can we protect the pan there? Try to get the alley-oop to surge, but um, for some reason, when I got bumped, I got into a weird animation. Then they try to get a oop of their own. Beverly trying to throw it up, but I believe it's Jeremy Land who rejects it. And then Karan Butler taking a bad step back shot. Ugh, not a good shot. Though. That's what I was saying, man. Sometimes the shooting guard would um take some weird shots. And this is one of the rare team up games where pretty much I think every single player, all 10 people, stayed in the game. The entire game. Usually you'll have a bunch of people quit. I mean, sometimes there'll be like 5 people less and like 4 people left by the end of the game because people will either quit or lag throughout. But this game, no lag, just mad fun, man. Mad fun. So it's me, back and Jeff. We're in the party. We're talking. We're communicating. We're having fun. The other two guys, we don't know them, but you know, we're still trying to get them involved. back being the point guard, trying to find the beat in the paint, and the beat gets the dunk to go that ties the game, and then Jeremy Lin Trying to avoid the shot blocking of Surge and then Surge trying to get that rebound. Go on, we'll get that rebound. All right, we'll just protect the paint instead. But they get another offensive board. That's one thing, man. They were just killing us on the boards. And Parsons again. We're just playing good defense, though. We're playing good defense. We forced them to just jack up a three there. Kind of open, kind of forced. There, we play good defense once again. Up three points. Westbrook on the break. Getting stripped by Jeremy Lin. And then you see Terrence Jones ahead of the pack. Only to get stripped right back. You see me trying to die for that one. Parsons out to Harden. Harden can't get the three to go. Surge, tired and all. Gets the rebound. Kicks out to Durant, who bobbles the pass. Out to Lamb. And Lamb draws the foul. And all of a sudden, it's looking like it's gonna be a good game man we were getting our asses whooped a little bit early but it's looking like a good game man two all great offensive teams a bunch of players who pretty much for the most part no one was doing any ridiculous stuff like, like taking a three-pointer every single time up the court if you play this mode you know what i'm talking about or just some dumb stuff like that everybody was chill for the most part i mean there was a few chuckers the chandler parsons guy was definitely a chucker but um I mean, there was nothing ridiculous, so it was mad fun playing this game. And you see, they throw the lob. Oh, man, Ushbeck just can't get the lobs to go this game. That's another turnover via lob pass. Obviously, we can run normal offense, but throwing lobs is more fun. And you see, I get called for a goal tending. I don't think that was going to get go in the basket anyways. And here, Chandler Parsons out to Royce White. And White, actually, that's not Royce White. I, I forget that dude's name, man. It's, oh, Troy Daniels. That's the dude's name. I, I remember 30 on the Rockets used to be um, Royce White, but... um. That's Troy Daniels. The other dude is the anxiety guy. It's Kevin Durant to beat the buzzer. Can't get it to go. Couldn't take advantage of my crash in the boards near the end of the third. Because Jeff was running back to play defense. I don't know why. Like five seconds left. I get to protect something. But, um... I, I didn't know that, so I just threw it back to Matt. It was nearly a backcourt. You see Reggie Jackson pulling up that three from way downtown. Now, Ushbeck had a lot of assists in the game. He also had a lot of, let's say, questionable shots, which, I mean, Ushbeck doesn't usually take, but it's just, when you play with Westbrook, that's what happens, man. You play with Westbrook, that's what happened. I, for the most part, I was not shooting well. I did not get the ball pretty much at all, so I'm shunned out. Now, it's just up to KD. It's up to KD, and KD was cherry picking, man, but his offense was going, all right? 26 points. Now, he's starting to heat up in this fourth quarter. I think he's already got four points. Good contest by Carlson, but Jeremy Lin, the high arcing shot goes. Rockets up by two. You see, defense starting to prevail in this second half for both teams. Jeff throwing the ball. Actually, it's not some. I don't even know who threw that ball. I think the center threw it way down for Jeff, and Jeff once again cherry picking with the rank, getting that to go. A little stat update as they call the timeout after Jeff got that bucket to go. Two tied game. Now the point guard playing with Patrick Beverly, but look at me absorbing the contact with Steven Adams to make sure nothing flies in the paint. Here the center leaves Terrence Jones wide open and unfortunately I get called for a goaltend trying to protect the paint. But for the most part, man, we were protecting the paint a lot in the second half. And look at Derek Fisher from downtown. Uzbek brings in deep fish and he gets it to go and then Fisher... Fisher poking the ball loose and on the run, you know who it is. It's Kevin Durant up the court. He's always the first one to the offensive bucket. I don't know why. Here, unfortunately, I believe that's Durant that got stripped and then Garcia and one. The bang and the 
bucket. But Garcia misses the free throw. Surge, 12th rebound of the game. Looking up court, looking up court. Finding Kevin Durant in the corner. But Durant can't get the three to go. Can't help me out with my low assist count. Just two assists. Trying to get something going here. I'm chasing down Lynn and getting the block. Lynn thought he had a free lane to the rim. But Surge says, no, no, no. Not today. Then Lynn for three. Trying to get redemption. And that's what he gets. And it's a four-point game with 223 left. We need to get the offense going. Lamb out to Durant. And one on Parsons. But I believe he missed the free throw. Then Harden gets a turnover because the center once again trying to get ambitious. Here's Surge setting the screen. Like I said, got to be a good teammate sometimes and get your teammates open. And that's what I did. Creating the good shot. Ushback takes the pull-up jumper and it's good. Unfortunately, Lin loses the ball. I believe Ushback stripped it, but it was a kick ball. And here, oh man, Jeremy Lin reversing to avoid the shot blocking prowess of Abaka and the other dude. Um, I, I believe that's the B. And you see Durant getting that bucket to go. Tying the game up. Jeremy Lin playing point. Trying to go in the paint. Out to a Sheik. He's scared of Surge, baby. He does not want me, man. He does not want to test me. But James Harden does. And he does not get away with it. On the boards, though, is Dwight Howard. And they get the put back to go. It's so frustrating when you play good defense. But your team doesn't get the board. But here, Durant. Bang! He's got it to go. Jeff helps us take the lead. With a minute 17 left with that three-pointer. Now Lynn out to Parsons. Parsons chucking it up. Can't get it to go. Offensive board by a Sheik. They're killing us on the glass. So many second chance opportunities. Lynn a free lane to the rim. Out to Harden. Harden can't get the three to go. Another offensive board. A block by Surge. Another offensive board. Dwight shot affected by Surge in the beat. And we get the defensive rebound. And on the break. It's Durant getting the layup to go. We're up by three now. We just need to close this game out. We need to get one stop, one rebound, and we're good. Lynn, scared of paint. Out to Parsons. Parsons chucking. Can't get it to go. Another offensive rebound, but Dwight can't get it to go. Surge affects the shot again. Surge, E, Blanca, and out to Westbrook, but Westbrook takes an ill-time shot. He just had to wait for them to foul, but Ushbeck takes an uncharacteristically bad shot. Shades of real life Westbrook as Garcia can't get three to, the three to go but no one gets the rebound. They miss another shot. Another rebound and I'm just poking. I'm poking. Don't let the three to go. If I foul him, I foul him. Set him to the free throw line and hope to God that Westbrook doesn't take another bad shot and we can go to the free throw line. Terrence Jones though knocks down both free throws and now I'm with five fouls. I can't foul again or else I foul out of the game. You can't foul out of the game with 11 seconds left. So we end up with the ball to Durant. Obviously, that's the plan. Inbound to Durant or um, Westbrook. So the center here just going to inbound the ball to Durant. But it's a turnover. A bad pass across the court. What was he thinking? Back to back bonehead plays and now we might lose this game only up by one with eight seconds left they call a timeout we got to make a defensive stand ball in james harden's hand game on the line harden rifling a pass right to serge Ibaka. adams on the recovery reggie jackson tosses it up and the game is over we come up with the big time stop with serge Ibaka. the game ending interception there as they try to squeeze that pass in I saw Dwight making a cut. I left my dude. I took a gamble, and it paid off, man. That's what you got to do sometimes. A gamble, and it pays off. So, I hope you guys do like on this video. If you enjoyed the game, the great finish, the surge of Baca heroics, Jeff balling with the rent, and I will catch you guys next time as you take a look at the stats.